Welcome back to Technique Quad. I'm Doug Larson. I'm here with former UFC heavyweight champion, Boss Rudin, and he's gonna teach us how to win a bar fight. Woo! Love it! All right, so in a bar fight, if someone comes up to you and they, they get right up in your face like this, what do you do? No, the thing, if you, you have to make sure, understand first, if this is gonna be serious. If you say, okay, his friends are backing up in the back, this guy needs to be canceled out really fast, really violently, so his friends are gonna be intimidated. Headbutt is the best weapon for that. I just need a little bit of, boom, this. So if he stands close, the only thing I need to do is little, create a little distance by stepping back, bang, and right away hit to the face, and then just keep going and <laughs> drop the guy down. Be crazy. I told my daughters, I said, just headbutt him in the face and be crazy. Beat the crazy bitch because then you will never fight again. And that's what you do when you are in a bar fight and <laughs> somebody comes up close to you. Not forehead to forehead though. You're going forehead to the nose. Forehead to the nose. It's very right. important. If he, if I, I'm standing here, normally I would always stand like this talking, you know, I listen, because this is my defense. If he would do something he would, with a headbutt coming, mm -hmm. I, I, I start, can't stop him. Mm -hmm. You know, so the trick is to hit You're standing him. like this on purpose? Yeah, yeah, okay. just like I'm talking to you, you know, like I'm, but this, I'm defending myself now. Mm -hmm. But I'm just, you know, what's going on? Once he comes close, you want to hit the nose. Mm -hmm. If he loads up for a headbutt for me, mm -hmm. load up and give me one, I do this. Okay. I lean forward and yeah. I let him hit his face into my head. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Okay, so what if someone comes up to you and they're, they're pointing you on the, on the chest? Okay, what you do then, you say, don't do that again. And what you, if you say that, of course they're going to do it again. And they do the same thing. It's a stupid thing. So he does it. I said, no, 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 don't do that again. As soon as they do it again, grab the finger, go all the way back. They shouldn't have pushed you against the chest. <laughs> Okay, so you're, maybe you're in an in a argument with somebody else and one of his buddies runs up behind you and starts, starts grabbing you and starts choking you. Once you start choking, what you want to do, you want to make sure that he doesn't pull his shoulder back and put you against his back. So right away, what you want to do is step to the side, step behind him, and now whoop, I can lift him and I can drop him or I can drop on him. And on the street, that's not going to be fun for him. <laughs> All right, three ways to keep yourself out of a bar fight. Thanks, boss. You're very welcome. You bet. Godspeed. Cool. Party on.